Welcome to Slide Egg. In this tutorial, let's learn how to create an animated travel map in PowerPoint. First, open your PowerPoint presentation and select any map of your choice. Next, insert a round shape to mark a specific area on the map. For example, let's start with Texas. Change the shape's color and remove the outline for a cleaner look. Now, mark a few other locations. Duplicate the round shape and place it on different areas. For instance, let's mark Illinois, North Dakota, Oregon, and New Mexico. In total, make sure to highlight at least 5 locations for the animation. Once the locations are marked, it's time to create a flight path. Insert a line and connect one shape to another. Adjust the line as needed, then right-click it, choose Format Shape, and increase the outline width to 5.5 points. For added style, select the Double Compound line type. Continue duplicating the line to connect other locations, connect Illinois to North Dakota, North Dakota to Oregon, and finally, Oregon to New Mexico. Now, add a flight icon to represent the travel. Adjust its size to fit the map. Rename it in the selection pane for easy identification, and temporarily hide it. Next, we'll animate the map. Start with the round shapes. Select the shape and apply the zoom animation. Set it to with previous and adjust the duration to 0.15 seconds. Then, unhide the flight icon and apply a fade animation. Set this to with previous as well with the same duration of 0.15 seconds. For the flight path, Select the line and apply the wipe animation. Set it to after previous and adjust the duration to 2.25 seconds. Now, add a line animation to the flight icon. You'll see two points, adjust the red point to connect it to Illinois. Then set the animation to after previous. Make sure the wipe animation starts with previous and add a delay of 0.25 seconds. To refine it further, click effect options and set smooth start and smooth end to 0 seconds. Let's make the animation more engaging. Add a fade animation to the flight icon, set it to after previous, and adjust the duration to 0.20 seconds. Now repeat the same steps for the other shapes and lines. Add a fade animation to each round shape with a duration of 0.15 seconds. Duplicate the flight icon, move it to the next location, and adjust the animation points. Add a fade animation to the flight icon, set it to after previous, and adjust the duration to 0.20 seconds. For a fun twist, add a spin animation to the flight icon. Set it to after previous and change the duration to 1 second. Click on the effect options, adjust the rotation to 85 degrees, and click OK. You'll notice the flight icon rotates clockwise. Now, go back to the effect options and change the direction to counterclockwise. Once that's done, test the animation by playing it. Next, select the animation line that's already been added. Click on the animation painter, then apply it to the line you want. The animation is added successfully. Move the animation one step up in the sequence. Adjust the duration to 2.25 seconds and set the delay to 0.25 seconds. Now, change the color of the flight icon. Repeat the same steps for the other two shapes. For the round shape, add a fade animation. Set it to play with the previous animation and adjust the duration to 0.15 seconds. Next, duplicate the flight icon and adjust the red point so it's positioned correctly.
Then, change the flight direction by going to the effect options and setting it to 45 degrees. Select the animation line again, use the animation painter, and paste it onto another line. The animation will be applied. Just change the animation direction to the right side. Move it one step up, and adjust the flight icon's color. For the round shape, add a fade animation. Set it to play with the previous animation and adjust the duration to 0.15 seconds. Now, duplicate the flight icon once more and position it at the final point. Adjust the flight direction to 125 degrees. Select the animation line, use the animation painter again, and paste it onto the line. Then, change the animation direction by selecting the bottom option. For the final round shape, add a zoom animation. Set it to play after the previous animation and adjust the duration to 0.20 seconds. Finally, change the flight icon's color. And that's it. Now you have an amazing animated travel map template. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed creating this animation.